What is up, boys and girls? Welcome back to another Aoki Tuber. Today, we're going to be playing some full lethality Halo Blades Poppy. Now, very recently, I did a coaching session for a low elo player trying to figure out how to climb on Poppy, and they were making the cardinal sin mistake of playing her as a tank, going aftershock and building tanky stats, uh, tanky items. But right now, guys, Poppy is a legit assassin, like straight up. You are going to be wanting to slam them into the wall and all in them with Ignite and Halo Blades. So four runes, you got Halo Blades, Sudden Impact, Zombie Ward, Treasure Hunter, Coup de Grasse, Triumph, AD, AD Scaling Health. And we are against an Ash and a Yumi. Which means they have really, really good sustained damage with Ash. So we need to be very, very um, decisive on the angles that we choose to fight. Because if I go in and we don't kill her, I'm getting kited down the entire lane. Knocked out Yumi. Not going to be able to kill her, but... At least keep her off. Ash, very nice. Good trade, good trade. So yeah, pop into Yumi. Um, this is a Yumi one trick, by the way. She has like 5 million points. I can ear and I can W her. Pretty, pretty hard counter to the champion, honestly. Might be down to look, go in here. It's kind of close to their turret. And we don't know where jungle's at. Uh, these next 30 seconds, we're probably just chilling right now. Let's just crash this wave. Uh, might be a go mid angle. Ain't gonna lie, it's looking pretty gankable, but I wanna stay down here, especially because we've got Ash on her deathbed. I'm chill out, play in the bush. Playing in the bush. If they step up here, it's go time. Is Udyr coming? Udyr could come down the river, I suppose. Oh my gosh, I want to go so bad. I want to go so bad. Alright, that's warded. I'm just trying to find the angle here. If she didn't have cleanse, I'd be looking for a flash stun into this wall. Juked. Take that trade. Don't really ever want to give Ash time to like auto W us there. God, they're playing so safe. There it is. There it is. Got her stunned. We're not going to be able to kill her. See, you're just looking to assassinate them, guys. You just wait for where they misstep one inch, slam them into the wall, get that easy kill. Like, technically, Lucian got the last hit, but I'm pretty sure we did, like, 90% of the damage there. And we see Udyr mid, so we know we can push this. Get our Q on the back line. Pop. Pop. And then we do not stay for the plate. That's a bait plate that will destroy your tempo. You want to go back, spin your gold, and get back in the lane. Um... I'm going to go ahead and sell my potion... There's nothing wrong with selling your pot to get boots, get back to lane faster. We don't need that potion anyways, guys. Often felt like Yumi's a bit overtuned. Overtuned? No, that champion is worthless. Y Yumi does like literally nothing. The only advantage she has is that she's like the easiest champ in the game to play. But like, nah, she is incredibly underst understated. I, I cannot believe this guy like one tricks Yumi. Like props to him, honestly. Don't think there's a world where Udyr's down here. Ah, right, whatever. It's just trade. Lucian, I need ya. I need ya, bruh. Ouch. See what I mean? Like, we definitely take uh, bad damage on the backside of the trade. Pop, pop. Beautiful. Love to see it. Just got to be decisive with it. Got to both be on the same page here. Uh, we can stay for the plate. Actually, we, we could... Oh, no. 
So little known fact guys, Udir's stun is actually a miniature little dash. I'm like 98% sure that it works like that on that champion. So when he go, when he, um, what is it? His WW maybe? Which one gives him a stun? I'm pretty sure he like lunges to stun and that's a dash, which means my uh, W cancels it. I'm like 95% sure that's true. E E. Okay, it's a, it's his E then. I can't think. I, I know there's a champion that that their point and click stun works like that. I just can't remember if it's Udir or not. All right, Lucian did not get a reset here, did he? Coming in behind him. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Up. 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 Love it. God, this champion's so busted. Oh, it's... Wait, I think it might be Volley. You're right, it might be Volley. I, I, I could be misinforming you here, guys. I, there's literally no chance this guy kills us, so... Just need to be brave, use our health bar, get the wave in. You're at E as a pounce. Okay, no, no, no. Okay, I shouldn't have doubted myself. It is Udir. Volley's is definitely a stun, but I think Udir's is too. It's like a little miniature dash. It is. See, I shouldn't have doubted myself, guys. Alright, well now we've got our ultimate. Which can of course be used two ways. You can use R for the disengage or just like the, the charge R for the disengage or just tap R just to extend your CC chain. Really, really nice. Very strong ability. Up, up. Get those for Lucian. All right, all four of my kills have gone on to Lucian. I would, oh. Sit over here because he's going to W through this bush. See, I think we just go. We go. We go. Yumi here. <laughs> I don't know what that Lucian flash was, but you, do you guys see how easy it is, man? You are an assassin. Do not play this champion like Leona. She's an assassin. We might have an angle to uh, dive her under the turret here. Yeah, we do. We do. She's not even level six yet. Diver. Definitely not as clean as it could have been. We missed the stun on the E, and then we kind of overextended our mana pool, so we didn't have enough for our ulti, but whatever. That's super worth. It's a one for one. Ash misses the entire wave, and she doesn't get a shutdown. We start the play, guys. Yeah, Ash is already down 30 CS. Like, is this champion balanced? Shut down. Need a Mumu to come with me here? I don't think I can kill this guy by myself. Aw, uh, he didn't come. Wow. Spell shield lasts forever. Here's in Bot River. I'm just going to pick up the uh, Luxus here. I think we shove this though. Just get prio. Now we can go down on bot lane again. I don't know how they snuck that dragon away from us. We have a hardcore winning bot lane. See if we can wrap around here, find anyone overextended. Nope, we can't. We can uh we we can last at this only though. We can slow push it. Oh. Oh my gosh. Wait, there it was, there it was. Did you guys see it? I grounded the Udir. I sh I should have knocked away the ash there, by the way. Eh, maybe not. Udir and Yumi being a two for one deal. Typically, you want to throw away their, like, consistent damage, but they're both... I, I, I think we might have made the right play. 
That Udir was like literally just chilling right outside of um <laughs> vision. When we went for Gromp instead of mid gank or Drake. Yeah. Can't control him though, man. All we can do is play the uh, cards we're dealt, you know? Here empowers his E, then the poppy dash stopper doesn't st work on it anymore. Well, he got grounded somehow, so. I had opportunity. I think that's a dive there by myself. I'm just shove this in. See Yumi above us. Yumi can absolutely never come into lane this way. She's chilling with Udir. I mean, whatever, bro. We're, we're pulling four, four people bot and we're vibing. Like, look what's happening to their top side. <laughs> Wait, do I die? Oh, it's not as funny anymore. What? That's crazy. What an insane rundown. Hmm. We needed to be 1% more respectful of the four man bot. Got another dragon going though. Okay, there's Ash Arrow. <laughs> they were so fed. We'll catch her here. Might be able to get Udir too. I mean, honestly, I'm kind of down to send it. You can get this wave in. Get the wave in. Get the wave in. Get the wave in. And we out. Easy, boys. In first turret in bot lane. Sorry, second turret in bot lane. All right. Uh, next item we can go Yomu's Axiom Umbral. The Serpent's Fang too. Honestly, Serpent's Fang's pretty gnarly item against these guys. Anti shield was pretty useful here. Oh, it's looking like a doomed play there. Bonk. I can kill this Ash. <laughs> oh yeah, Th hey, this champion seems pretty normal. Oh my god, we might be the goat. We salvaged the hell out of that play for Lucian. Holy. And we got the sun on New Deer again. Pick up my shield. Lucian, I still need you, bro. You can't leave me. You can't leave me. You can't leave me, bro. You can't leave me. Listen, we go down for our team there. That is a heroic support sacrifice. I think if Lucian had stayed closer, I could have lived too, but we protected a shutdown, so I'm okay with it. I 
I mean, that's the crazy thing about like Poppy is she's so good against like it, mobile champions who dash and don't have blinks, but she's also super good at just popping immobile champions and like immobile champions like Volibear and Udir who happen to have like a little micro dash. Like, dude, the, the W is just the best ability in the game. What One of the best uh, basic abilities in the game. It's right up there with like Thresh Lantern. Literal 100 to 0 her by, by myself, by the way. That was that was by myself as support. We just 100 to 0 that Ash. Insane, bro. It's insane. Hey, yo. It's gone, kind of going crazy topside. Bonk, bonk, bonk. Nothing to see here, guys. Just uh, counter jungling as Poppy. Support. It's having a little. Oh my god! Zeri is normal! Uh. If you can make a broken support using any ability off any champion, which four abilities would you give them? Uh. Thresh Lantern, Blitzcrank Hook. I I have no idea, bro. I'm I feel like I'm just making another Hook champion. <laughs> like, I don't know. I'd have to think about that. Like, can I only take one Q, one W, one E, and one R? Oh no. Vision there, I guess. Oh, I'm dead here. Oh, I'm super. Bro, whoa! The collapse of the century. Get up, Moo Moo! Avenge your poppy! Yes! You love to see it. My teams today have been actual, like, human beings. It's been really nice. Jono, good to see you, homie. Welcome, welcome back. One for four worth, yeah. It's important to not like pat yourself on the back for, back for that, though. Don't be the guy who just dies for free, but then your team carries the fight and it's like, uh, focus the support more. Like I definitely grieved. It was a good result, not a good play. You know what I mean? It's it's very important to. Make a distinction between the two. What's this? Bonk. One more hit. They're getting tossed around in their own jungle. Been busy with university, so I haven't been able to tune into streams, but I'm keeping up with all your YouTube videos. Yo. Well, happy you uh happy you were able to make this one, man. What up, what up? We vibing today. It's a, it's a nice rainy Sunday afternoon. Do you represent America in the Olympics esports? I would go further than that. I would I would go so far as to say if they don't pick me to represent America, we're not going to win. It's a doomer. I freaking lost vision. I think Lucian wipes him. I'm gonna be real. Oh, what was that, bro? Oh, 
whatever. Did I never buy boots this game? <laughs> wait, what? Wait, what? have I been playing this whole game without boots? Wait, it's... Oh, I sold them, I sold them. Okay, 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 okay. Right? Chat. Certainly I've had boots, right? You guys would have told me. Nice. First item was Swifties. Okay, okay, okay. So I just accidentally sold them. I don't know. I was eating a sandwich. What are you good for? Other than eating a sandwich. Oh yeah, I sold, I sold pot for it. Ouch. Well, we know there's a Yumi ward in that bush. Incredibly enough, we don't have a dragon wind con to play for. These guys are starting to be like really, really safe. We're gonna have to start forcing some plays here. Maybe, maybe bring them to Baron. Can Baron. We need our Mumu though. We can Baron and like force him to play into this choke, and then it's easy pickings. Whoa, whoa. Oh. Got the Yumi stunned. Oh, barely avoided the Ash W2. That would have killed me. Oh my God. Well, that was a very suspect start to a team fight, but you know what? It all turned out okay. Mr. Mayhem with the prime for 12 months. Thank you very much. Into the FF. Boom. Another victory for the GOAT, my friends. GG's. It definitely was a top gap. It definitely was a bot gap. I, you know, it's up in the air about the other two, but. Not too bad, fellas. GG's all around. That right there is why you play Poppy as an assassin. We outdamaged every single person on their team. Still had incredible uh, peel. Still had incredible engages. You're still relatively tanky because of your passive, the shield, the buckler, the pickup. But yeah, that's how you actually play Poppy support. Wasn't a perfect game, but it was, it was a pretty good representation of why this champion's broken. So if you guys enjoyed, let me know what you guys think about the build strat down in the comments. We'll take it easy. Peace out.